Hello, my name is John Sayer, Technical Marketing Manager, Civil Infrastructure here at Autodesk. Today, with the help of Jeff Lyons, I would like to present the What's New features of AutoCAD Civil 3D 2017. AutoCAD Civil 3D software is a mature civil engineering design and documentation solution that supports building information modeling workflows. AutoCAD Civil 3D 2017 offers improved usability and greater efficiency with overall project workflows, detailed design, and interoperability improvements. As we go through the presentation, you will see that 2017 enhancements fall into four primary categories. These include project management, usability, corridor modeling, and collaboration and data exchange. Our first category is project management. This first set of demonstration is packed full of new and improved workflows to help streamline project data management for any project. Reference Styles Utility is a powerful new feature that allows any styles in an existing drawing be synchronized with the styles in an external reference template. The new ability to cache a surface means that you can save the geometry of a reference surface in a design drawing that contains the data shortcut reference. Creating a corridor data shortcut and referencing it in a working drawing is now available in AutoCAD Civil 3D 2017. Other improvements to project management that have been added to AutoCAD Civil 3D include the ability to create data shortcut folders to help manage object shortcuts in a project. To complement the new folder system for creating references, AutoCAD Civil 3D has the new option to multi-select individual data shortcuts or a complete folder with multiple data shortcuts and drag and drop them into the drawing. This new feature of AutoCAD Civil 3D 2017 allows the user to reference Civil 3D styles in a drawing or a template. So this means you can have a production drawing with current styles and at any time reference that external template or drawing to access their styles. In this demonstration, we've created a template called mycivil3dstyles.dwt. I've gone ahead and reviewed the fact that there's some city standards, there's some custom styles based on specific project type. So as you can see, anything from surface uh, styles to profile view styles can be stored in your template. This isn't new. So now if we open up our production drawing, so these are drawings that have already been created, whether it's been through manual process or using the plan production tools. Now using the manage uh, option in the ribbon, you'll see a new styles option called reference. So using the reference, we can uh, attach one or more DWTs or DWGs to our existing production drawing. So if you've got a hundred planet profiles and you want to change the style of a profile or a pipe label, this new feature is so valuable. So once you've attached the style in the prospector menu, you'll see now any of the styles that we created in the My Styles template. So now we've got, uh, for example, under the surface style, we had a contour every six inches in our template, and now it appears in the production drawing. So we'll just go through a couple more examples. But basically, once you've attached that reference style, you have access to all of the new uh, content that's been externally referenced. Let's change the style of our production profile. In this case we'll pick the city standard. Maybe it'll be a different color or a different label set. If we wanted to apply a different label set we could. So once we change that to the city standard we know that it's externally referenced and we know that it's correct as per the city standard. Of course, the connection is dynamic. 
So if we were to change the style in our template, this style changes in our production drawings. So if you're a CAD manager and you're managing uh, a group of designers and CAD drafters, you can externally reference the uh, production drawings to a specific template and if you want to refine those styles you can refine them and they'll be dynamically updated back in the uh, production set. It's a very powerful feature. If we want to update our production drawings using the new city standard change we can open up any of the production drawings that are referenced to that template select the reference option again and then you'll be notified that it needs to be reloaded. Once you reload it then any of the styles that are used in this production drawing will be updated. In this case you'll see the profile uh, style get updated. This new feature called Surface Cache allows the user to make a decision whether they want to send the surfaces out